HIU was incorporated on October 9, 1928 as Pacific Bible Seminary. The Alvarado Church of Christ in Los Angeles served as the campus where the first classes were held the following January. As the school's founders recruited a president, the task of hiring faculty and establishing the curriculum was handled by Robert Elmore, the first dean. The next year, a church in Long Beach invited the seminary to meet in its building, and the pastor of that church, George Taubman, became the new dean. It wasn't until a year after classes began that James Hurst, who was the pastor of Huntington Beach Church of Christ, agreed to assume the position of our first president. He worked part-time while continuing his church ministry, maintaining that dual role for 23 years. Shortly after the establishment of Pacific Bible Seminary, the stock market crashed in 1929, marking the beginning of the Great Depression. From a practical perspective, it would be difficult to think of a worse time to establish a new private institution. But the people who served the seminary persevered. Disaster struck in 1933, in the depths of the Great Depression. An earthquake destroyed the church where the seminary was meeting. Some might have interpreted that as a sign from God to forget the dream. Instead, the school moved into a small house in Long Beach and continued its mission. A few years later, the institution bought a small property and built its first real campus. For the first 25 years, everyone who served at the institution was a part-time employee. The school hired the first full-time president and full-time professor in 1954. The institution became Pacific Christian College in 1962, and in 1973, PCC moved to its current campus in Fullerton. The Board of Trustees voted in 1997 to change the name to Hope International University. HIU experienced the Great Recession in 2008, along with the rest of the country and most of the world. Many of HIU's alumni, donors, and churches experienced serious adversity. We have a legacy of persistence through adversity and trials. When you believe in something, you just don't give up. In 2016, Nebraska Christian College merged with HIU, establishing a presence in the Midwest with a branch campus in Omaha, Nebraska. I doubt anyone would have ever anticipated that HIU would someday have a branch campus near Omaha or that we would be offering online programs to thousands of students all over the world. The total number of graduates during those first 25 years combined was fewer than 150. We now graduate more students than that each semester. Dr. Gary Tiffin, a former academic dean, once asked this question. Can a college which exists in a rapidly changing world function according to its original purpose? HIU will continue to experience inevitable changes, and therefore, they are calling the university to a renewed commitment to the three core values that gave birth to the institution's mission. We must preserve and renew our wholehearted commitment to the authority of the Bible as the infallible Word of God, to the Lordship of Jesus Christ in all we do, and to preparing exceptional servant leaders. This is our God-given mission. It is vital to keep in mind that your investment in HIU does not impact just what happens next week or next semester. Those seeds of faith may have a 90-year horizon that will reap a harvest in multiple generations to come. God has placed the fate and future of HIU in our hands, and we have a shared responsibility to care for what has been entrusted to us. May the God who established and sustains us continue to keep us faithful to His purposes.